So radiotherapy is used to treat bladder cancer in two main scenarios. Firstly, it is used as an alternative to surgery as a curative treatment for locally advanced bladder cancer. This allows the bladder to be preserved uh, and hopefully leading to a good quality uh, bladder function in the future. The second use of radiotherapy is in the palliative treatment uh, to improve quality of life, particularly when the cancer has spread. So for example, it can be used to treat a painful area of cancer in the bone, or indeed the bladder itself for things like a persistent uh, blood in the urine. Curative radiotherapy for bladder cancer is typically given over a period of four weeks. Uh, when we talk about palliative radiotherapy for symptom control, that is usually shorter and could be anything from one day to two weeks. So for the curative uh, radiotherapy treatments, we usually give 20 sessions of radiotherapy, each lasting approximately 20 minutes. And that is over a period of four weeks. When it comes to palliative radiotherapy for symptom control, we will usually give either one dose of radiotherapy or sometimes longer courses up to five or 10 doses. So the side effects of radiotherapy to the bladder are usually divided into three main categories. The first one is tiredness. The second one is urinary side effects. So this is predominantly cystitis type symptoms. So by that, I mean frequency, urgency of urine, burning or stinging when passing urine. The third category is bowel side effects, and these are predominantly diarrhea, urgency, and blood in the motions. So these side effects come on very gradually during a course of treatment and will take up to four to six weeks to settle down after the treatment has finished for a course of radical or curative radiotherapy. So radiotherapy is mainly used in locally advanced bladder cancer rather than early stages of bladder cancer. So at this point, it is an aggressive cancer, but on average, about half of the patients treated uh, with curative radiotherapy will be cured. Yes, so bladder cancer radiotherapy is becoming more and more cutting edge as technology advances. An example of this would be the fact that uh, we can now uh, do special imaging during the treatment every day so that we are very clear where the bladder is and what the volume of the bladder is. This has led to a reduction of the volume of the body being uh, irradiated, uh, leading to a reduction in the urinary and bowel side effects. One other aspect of bladder radiotherapy that is cutting edge uh, is the addition of um, chemotherapy or high concentration oxygen at the same time as having radiotherapy. And this has been shown to make the radiotherapy more effective in terms of the cure rates. So this is a new advance, which is now standard of care. There are also some new things uh, being looked at, uh, predominantly in clinical trials. And one exciting avenue we are investigating is the addition of uh, immunotherapy alongside chemotherapy with radiotherapy.